Hi everyone, Tuesday, August 16th, and of course, like every Tuesday, we do the Mortgage Minute where we're covering what's going on with interest rates in about a minute. You can see right here on the screen, right around 5.3, not much has changed since last week. In fact, not much at all has changed uh, in the past couple of weeks. Even with the big uptick from the Fed not long ago, we're still kind of in this range where, you know, the 10-year the, the treasury is a little bit below three, it's a little bit above three, but not a tremendous amount in the interest rate change. Most mortgages are somewhere in the high fours to low fives, jumbo product, 30-year fix, conforming, high balance, conforming, whatever it may be, uh, whatever you can ultimately get your hands on, depending on leverage and your FICO score. But I, I really want to caution about this. We are in a really interesting place because obviously the market, the stock market has had a really good month. Uh, the past month, everybody's kind of excited, but we're still in this weird place. Kind of, I don't want to call it the eye of the storm, but the expectation is, again, we are not heading into a great direction towards the end of this year. We'll see what happens. Not going to make too many prognostications, but there's still this feeling like interest rates are going to continue to go up. By the end of the year, uh, the stock market is not going to keep this up. The economic forecast is not so strong heading towards the end of this year and the beginning of next Again, not saying all that's going to happen, just be prepared for it. It's a really good time right now still to buy. The rates are still really, really, really good. In the history of what interest rates are to be in the high fours, to be in the low fives, that is still tremendous. When it hits 6 7 and maybe even 8%, not too long in the future, it's not going to look as pretty. So keep that in mind if you're out there and do want to buy something.